A short time ago, Tropical Storm Rena formed in the Atlantic. We are just cruising through the alphabet. Elizabeth Gardner is in the WRL Severe Weather Center, keeping an eye on its track as well as Philippe's. Yeah, we only have four or five names left on the list, and now here we are just uh, not quite to October yet. So Philippe is here and Rena is here. These two are very close together. Uh, we'll talk a little bit more about Philippe coming up, but you can see it here, both of them almost looking like one big storm here. Uh, Rena is 1,100 miles east of the the Leeward Islands moving north at 10 miles per hour and has 40 mile per hour wind. So it's a it's a weak tropical storm at this point. Um, we're looking at it traveling in a different direction from Philippe. Philippe looks like it's going to hang out down here and uh, head down to the south and west. And we'll take a look at that in a few minutes. But this one definitely bears watching. The forecast path of this storm aims it up toward Bermuda by the time we get to Tuesday at uh, 8 uh, a.m. But take a look at the computer model plots for this. There is no real good consensus here. A few of them don't take it anywhere near Bermuda and just turn it up into the Atlantic. Uh, one of them takes it down to the Leeward Islands and a couple of them do bring it over toward Bermuda. So we'll keep our eye on it. You know, anything that's headed toward Bermuda is something that we'll be watching very closely. We would have, you know, over a week before it had any effect in the United States, if it did. Um, and again, coming up, we'll take a close look at Philippe and some improving weather across our area.